This is the Burlington Arcade, a third shopping district, quite close to the other two. But you'll notice it's different. It's covered. It was built in 1819, and for almost 200 years, it has been a model for every shopping mall that has been built since then. A model for the Piccadilly Arcade, a model for the Galleria Vittorio Emanuel in Milan, a model for the Galleria in Houston, Texas. This land was owned by Lord George Cavendish, who had bought Burlington House, a splendid Palladian residence nearby, which now houses the Royal Academy. Now, according to legend, uh, Lord Cavendish had a problem, which is that people kept on depositing oyster shells in this area. So he decided to cover it up, make it a house for shops, a place that would bring enjoyment to ordinary Londoners and employment to, as he put it, industrious females. It has been a success for two centuries. It's a natural way for shops to share public goods, security, a roof, and the customers that come to one then come to the other. It is yet another example of an urban innovation that happened in London and then was copied throughout the world.